Right, well, if you park on the car park at the Ruskin Glass Centre, then you walk up the ramp behind me through the big gates, and you'll come up here. Get to the um, get to the fountain, and come down here. But some people might come in that entrance straight off the road, right the way down there, and come in. And um, and this is it. This is the art centre, the Glass House Art Centre. And uh, we're just going to do one table. What I like, what I don't like, what I think looks good. I'm not sure about and how quiet have I got to be look at this it's very nice Christopher Day under the influence series. No, oh, nice prices, and I've seen these before. And um, they're slightly mad. So it's copper tube, and um, the the glass is blown within the copper tube, and they're just the colours are fantastic. Colours are fantastic. We love this. We love this. Look at that, look at that. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And I love the little tops, the little ropey tops. A great, beautiful. There you go. Right, let's have a look over here. Uh, Angela Steele, oh wow. Oh no, there's something really... Wow. These are beautiful. Wow, look at the detail in this. Look at him. Oh, very cool, very cool, love that. This, I'm not sure about this, I've seen this a couple of times. And, um... It's a little bit, it is, it's a glass blown within a slinky. Oh, okay, so these are the stairs, right, I get you, these are the stairs, and it's glass blown within a slinky. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, glass blowers. Slightly mad. That's beautiful, love it. Very good. Oh, there you go. Of course it is. Poor row bottom. Very good, very good. You like that one? Let's have a look. Ah, oh, right. Ian Chadwick. This never fails to amaze me. How oh, the glass. This is glass. This is just like marquetry, parquetry taken to a next level, but not in wood. In glass, and I just. It's crazy good. Andrea Spencer. That's cool. That's cool. Love it. Yeah, I'm not going to touch it. I'm not going to risk touch it. Oh, this is... Oh, okay. Blocks of glass fused, cast, maybe. This is crazy. Look at that. Colin Reed. Oh, that's why it's crazy. Kilncast. 26k. Wow. Look at it. It's mad. It's mad. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. 26k beautiful? I don't know. I suppose some people, 26k is nothing. That is, yeah, I like that. That's cool. Uh, what have we got going on here? Oh, Keith, Keith Bucklehurst. He's here at the Ruskin Glass Centre, Framework, and Neon.
Next. James Devereux. Oh, I've heard of this guy. Ah, right. Look at that price. Okay, now this. I looked at this the other day, and this is off the scale too. So I think we've got some sort of 3D printed base, which is like a lattice and a network inside there, supporting a glass, and a glass tube that almost looks like it should be a candle, but crazy good. Another one here, same as the first one. That's mad. Looks great, doesn't it? Looks great. That's great. Yeah, like it. Very good. This one, Alison Lowry. Uh, oh, blimey. What have we got? Verity Pulford, High Verity, Micro Studies. Oh, they're cute. Yeah, very good. I love this. Tinker. You can read it. They're good, aren't they? Here we go, Tinker Tailing, stained glass. Rachel Mulligan. I like them, Rachel. They're very good. Uh, Michelle Keeling. Has she got a piece in the contemporary glass postcards? I think she had. These are great. So I can see there's air bubbles there, so there's laminations fused. That's cool. This thing is sort of crazy. And this is, and I've never met the guy, but this is Alistair Malcolm. Lead crystal stain, steel, burn glass, cut and bonded, 18K. And it's mad but cool. Yeah, I like that. I think I like it. I'm not sure. Emoji type thing. I'm not sure. It's... I don't know. What do you think? Let me know in the comments.